thank you to all of you guys for having us and all the partners here. And um, it's a pleasure to be on Treaty 6 land. And um, it's obviously going to be a special weekend and pleasure to be here for sure. Um, being able to compete at a level of this or a competition of this magnitude in Canada is super special. It doesn't come around very often. So um, it's an honor to be here in Edmonton. And I can't wait to see the stands full and um, the excitement because, as you guys know, there's not really any high end snowboard competitions that have ever graced the lands of Edmonton. So um, <laughs> this is really special and I'm um, a proud to proud to be here and I'm looking forward to competing. This is a totally new scaffolding jump, a, a totally new design that actually is uh, aligned with the progression of snowboarding and where it's at today. So I think you're going to see some of the highest level of riding um, that goes down. So very excited and um, I just want to talk about the importance snowboarding has had on my life and sport in general. Um, I, I had every opportunity to play pretty much every sport under the sun and I think Sport teaches us a lot of life lessons and um, taught me a lot about how to treat people and how to go about my daily life. And um, you can learn a lot of lessons through sport. And that's the main reason why we started the McMorris Foundation. The McMorris Foundation is a program helping underprivileged youth find their passion through sport. Um, because as we know, sports cost money. and. Uh, we want every kid to have the same opportunity that my brother and I had, and um, that leads me to my next point where I would like to announce that the McMorris Foundation will match Canada Snowboard's donation of $15,000 to the Indigenous Sports Council of Alberta. So it's a pleasure to be, be able to announce that. Have you gone yet, Marcus? What? Have you gone yet? No. Oh, sh First time. I'm scared. Oh, wow. It's definitely getting faster. What's up with that? It's super slow. Really? The end run just starts with not enough? Yeah, they need to like... I think, I think honestly, if they added like this much and it was all steep, it would help, but it. I think you'll you'll like it. Like the jump's yeah. sick, but it goes up for every. Yeah, you lose momentum. It's cool. I think it'll be fine. Yeah, Jakey. Nice yeah, to bro. see you, buddy. Yeah. How did first practice go? Uh, it got better as it went on. Some, some bananas hanging around. <laughs> I didn't slip on any banana peels out there, so that was good. Um, they have plans to make it a little bit better, which is good. Um, all in all, you never come to these things on the first day and say it's perfect, so. It's just growing pains and it's gonna be great. We just gotta keep riding it and do the little tweaks and should be okay. Cheerio. I'm on video now, buddy. Nice cam. <laughs> this is my first hockey game. Holy shit. <laughs> All time. You ever been? Games has Takaru been to? Is your first one? First game? Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's all she wrote. Uh, they smoked them. 8 2. Lovely to come check out the Oilers play. Had a great time. You guys want to go out? She was like, come on. 
a high school football team. But uh, we're just gonna go hit a big air jump instead. But it's nice to have your own locker, right? You can keep your gear hung up, dry it out. Don't need to take it home every night. So yeah, it's like nice to be at home right now, playing home games and always nice to get on the road. But yeah, we're at home this weekend, so. Skate hard. Skate hard, dump and chase, short shifts. And keep your head up. Switchback 5. Also, tell him he looks f***ing sick. Mark also says he looks f***ing sick. Mark is the top of that. Nice! Ah. Yeah, just keep letting it set up by your right, like every time it gets raked and then just more people get on it right away it's like never really has time yeah well thanks for the help man appreciate it nice to see you bud not really feeling much uh much confidence with like a bigger switch backside spin with the takeoff like that it's just i mean that one was straight but like i basically did a switch ollie switch back 12 like i had no i did it all in the air yeah, I'm gonna go do a front 10 and then do a front trippy, I think. And that, those last two front triples, is, I landed where I wanted. But with switch backside, like, dude, the takeoff is sugar one of the switchback 12s i went for i had some power and like tomorrow it's good so like maybe i just go back to that but i was like at least if it's not working i've done a friend triple and i know and what's up rusty thanks chair bear I don't really know what to do. I'm probably gonna get another one, yeah? Maybe I should do one more backside and then end on front side. crowd we've got. We've gone for quality, not quantity today. We've got the McMorrises here. We had the school kids in earlier, so we might not quite get the same height. And dropping up next, the hero, the legend from 800Ks just down the road is, of course, Mr. Mark McMorris. Yeah, buddy. Here at the style experience. First time here in Edmonton. Here we go, what's Mark got for us on his first hit? On trigger 14, yes! Puts it down! Woo. That's not a bad birthday present, is it? On your first hit. Front time trigger 14. It's a shame we don't have the kids who were here before, they can start singing for you, Mark. Happy birthday! Okay, scores coming in for Mark. It is a 70.25 and into that third position. 
like that was that was kind of like one foot on the high side of the first line and maybe one on the maybe a little lower than okay well i got one down so thank you next six riders will go in ready for the hero of the start list right now ladies and gentlemen mark morris well, if you might say, oh, I just lived down the road. So, you know, it's like another eight hour drive. Like eight hours you can drive across Europe. And here we go, Mark coming into the second run. Triple 14. Yes, hold it on. Hold it on. Solid. There we go, 74 points. Instead of just hanging out like this in it, I like started getting on top of my board instead of waiting till the rotation's done and then it makes you do a front roll out. F and next up, here he goes, dropping in, Mark Morris, of course. Whoa! There it is. That is how you put it down. Scores oh. coming in, 78.5 in the second position. position. Mark Morris, Morris. I think you're in response to the finals. finals. Did you sneak in four through nine? Yeah, I'm on the Good job. Yeah, nice to be able to snowboard tomorrow when everyone's here. Yeah. It'll be exciting. Yeah, yeah, for sure. We just finished up the qualification day here in Edmonton. It was a battle for me. I uh, landed the first one, didn't get the score I was hoping for. Kind of blew it on my second jump, and then I got in there and laced it up on the third jump. So extremely pleased. Uh, would have been a sad little birthday of mine if I didn't make it in there and um, obviously the fans weren't here today but there's a lot of tickets sold for tomorrow so I'm glad I'm actually in the main show um, top three from each heat made it to finals and I was third in my heat so I'm going straight to finals very pleased excited for all the Sasky boys to be here checking it out and um, yeah it's just cool to compete in this stadium and looking forward to tomorrow and hopefully you can hoist it Nothing. I, I just need more speed. Front I, yeah. The front 14, yeah. Backside, I was struggling a bit. Really? Okay. Yeah, it's like, if, if, I swear, it's like I should just try and go as big as I can on a front triple. And then do a back 14. Has Jake been sinking a couple? Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm bib too. I was like, what?
Thank you. Thanks. Uh, I wish it would have been a little bit quicker and um, had a better showing, but that's okay. Um, it's competition. Uh, I hope people just keep coming out to watch snowboarding and we can do some more of this. And I mean, it seems like a pretty good turnout. And yeah, just uh, thanks for, for uh, putting it on, everyone. Thank you, Mike. Thanks. Cheers. Can we grab a pet? Yeah, of course. Thank you. Hi. Thank you. How you doing, bud? How you doing? Good. Thanks for coming. Yeah. Sorry. That was brutal. Thanks for coming. You all good? Good job last night, too. What's up, bro? Good to see you. Hi, Lauren. How are you? Nice to see you. Long time. Hey, Ty. Thank you. You're the man. Thanks for coming. Great job. Ah, that was brutal. Thank you guys for coming. That was so frustrating, though. Ah. Let's go sink a few, maybe. Yeah. Oh, it's awful. So frustrating. Like this, when you're like fighting for speed, like usually you should be able to like ditch it and be able to go a bit further into the landing and have the time to do your tricks. And I was just like struggling a lot with like getting to the spot in the landing I'd like to, to be able to do what I want to do. And I don't know. It's kind of all on me though. Anyways, I can't really blame it on anyone. There's a million things that go through your head after. You're like, should it on this, should it on that. So it's all good. Yeah. Thank you guys for coming. Anyways.